بسم الله الرحمن الرحیم in the continuation of accounting terminology next one is 22 expense expense چی مانا میتا مصرف یا خرچ مصارف جمعش میشه money value paid or payable for goods or service in the course of business operation is called what? expenses expenses is the cost of the use of the things or the services for the purpose of generating revenue It is the monetary value of what? Input. See the point. Expense means the amount you have to pay or the amount which you paid for receiving of goods or services from others can be called as what? Expense. Or the amount you paid or payable because of running of the business. So those things can be called as what? Expenses. For example, you purchase good is the expenses. You, for example, pay salary for the employees, expenses. You pay rent, you pay food expenses, you pay electricity expenses. Several things that you have to pay in order to run your business is called what? Expenses. Masarif chiz yez ki yani shumo bayad bu pardazen ke business ton chi shawa? Business ton pesh bura da gaya zog business pesh na meira. Ki ba tu muft kaar mei kena? Ma wada khama ki barat mei ta? Bala barq ta ma bu pardazen? Say sani? نو نت امپلایر امپلای باید کار میکنه نه اینی چیزایی که در مجموع تو باید بپردازی and you have to consume it during the operation of the business in order to generate revenue this can be called as what expenses هر آن چیزی که تو دست میتی یا باید بپردازی یا خواد پرداختی به خاطر که بزنس تو آپریت کنه یا رن شوه و فایده تولید کنه ای رو بانامی چیاد میکنه expenses یاد میکنه Yeah, definition is audacious. It is the monetary value of input. Monetary value of input be mona ke chidre ke shuma chi mekrin dakhal business miyarin. Ar on paisi ke bakhater jinsai ke me pardazen ya paisi me pardazen ke jins ad dakhal business biyarin ya khidamat ad dakhal business biyarin bana mi chiyad mishin? Bana mi chiyad mishin? Ya masra. Next one is expenditure which is also similar to expense but there is a little bit difference. See, in this case we said Money value paid or payable for goods and for services. Maga the expense, but yak chiz garam chime kam isafa mekri. Money value paid or payable in exchange for an asset, goods or what? Services. So expense include only revenue and what? And services. But expenditure include the amount which you pay or you put as payable for purchase of asset, for purchase of goods, or for purchase of what? اسید به ایمانو که لند بلدنگ ماشین و غیره چیزا با اونا مگه پایسا می پرده دیوری چی مگه اکسپنس می دهد مگر اکسپندیچر مگه اونه اکسپنس گفته نمی تنیم ار وقت که دو بلدنگ خریدی ماشین خریدی و غیره اونه اکسپنس نگو اونه چی بگو اونه اکسپندیچر بگو رند, خ... رند پرداختی سالری پرداختی غذا و غیره مسائل خود ریزی مواده خام خریدی اونه چی بگو برش؟ برش Two types of expense we have. Two types of expenditure. Capital expenditure and revenue expenditure. Purchase of fixed assets. If you purchase machine, land, buildings and so on. So that amount which you pay for the purchase of fixed assets and so on can be called as which expenditure? Capital expenditure. And this is of course non-recurring like this one. Like capital receipt that's also non-recurring and that appear in balance sheet. And this one is also It is non-recurring and this appears in what? In balance sheet. Bardan baldira. Maanay da khikhsha. Nei khamay. On the other side, we have review and expenditure. Review and expenditure is same like this one. Review and expenditure is same like this. Like review and receipt. And that one is for goods and service and appear in what? Profit and loss. So, review and expenditure means purchase of goods or service. And that is recurring and that one appears in what? In profit. ما صورت فای خورد ریزی که تو می پردازی باز اینی رفیون اکسپندیچر اینی است. رجیسی؟ پس اکسپندیچر دو چیده در برداره. کپیتل اکسپندیچر اند رفیون اکسپندیچر. اونلی رفیون اکسپندیچر کن بی کالد از وات؟ از اکسپنس. سو اکسپنسز از ا پارت اف وات؟ اکسپندیچر. رایت؟ سو ما صورت فای که با همه چیز پرداخته میشه؟ اکسپندیچر. و ما صورت که تنها با مسائل پیش برد روزمره بزنس پرداخته میشه چی گفتم میشه؟ درست؟ سو اکسپندیچر مینز دی پیمنت فور پرچیس اف لند اند بیلڈنگ اند سو اون 
and as well as for day to day expenses of business. This can be called a lot of expenses. Next one is cost. Cost monometer, has in monometer. It is the measure of expenditure. It may be expired on and expired. If you use the resource in the business for production of anything, that resource can be called as well. That consumption can be called as well as cost. So cost can be expired, cost can be unexpired. What is expired cost? It is that part of the expenditure, like part of what? Part of expenditure. It is that part of the expenditure which is used up while generating revenue during the accountancy year. شما در ابتدای سال به خاطر تولیدات رفتن ده تن مواد خام خریدین چند تن مواد خام خریدین ده تن از ده تن مواد 8 تنش در جریان سال به خاطر تولیدات استفاده کردین این می ارزش 8 تن که استفاده شده فکر رو به تمام سال 50000 افونی میشه این رو بنام چی یاد میگیرم اکسپایرد کاست ات از دت پارت اف دی اکسپندیچر ویچ از یوز اپ وایل جنریتینگ ریونیو دیورینگ دی اکاونٹنگ پریود در جریان سال اون مو قسمت مواد که استفاده کردن ارزش پولی چه بنام چیات میکنن اکسپایرد کاست اند اف کورس ان دیس کیس اکسپایرد کاست بیکام وات بیکام اکسپنس اون دی ادر سایت ان اکسپایرد کاست ات از دت ات از دی ان یوتیلایزد کاست ویچ ریمین ان کنزیومد ات دی اند اف اکاونٹنگ پریود ده تن مواد خام خریدن 8 تنش استفاده شد چند تنش باقی مونده دو تنش باقی مونده ارزش اونم چند است اونو به نام چی یاد میکنن ان اکسپایرد کاست بول بعدن اینو میخورین که ان اکسپایرد کاست به نام اسست یاد میکنن به نام چی یاد میکنن ات کان بی کالد از اسست درست است سو پلیز گیت دی دیفرنس بیتوین دیس تینگز ناو لیت اس سی دی فیو سیورال اگزامپل اف اکسپنسز پرچیز کاریج ان ورد ترانسپورتیشن مونومتر ویجز مارش فرید کرایا حمل نقل Octroy is a kind of tax. Packaging, packaging, salary, rent, rent and stationery, postage and telephone, masoile post office, insurance, masoile bima, audit fee. Kasoi ka accountor check mekane ki mukhlaf fee migra, auditor mekane shko. Badan bas shom mefam ki chhimon bata fee. Repair and maintenance, legal fee, legal expenses, electricity and power, depreciation, istihlak. Shom manai shabar tam kol shabar idar kren dressat. Commission, commission, traveling expenses, brokerage, this is broker, Tra trade expenses, advertisement expenses, promotion, bad debts, discount allowed, royalty fee. What is royalty fee? For example, if you use the name of other companies in your product, so that for that purpose you have to pay some fee. That can be called as what? As a royalty fee. Royalty fee. For example, Habib Gozar is using the name of Coca Cola, right? So for that purpose, Habib Gozar is paying a fee for the Coca-Cola company. That can be called royalty fee. Interest on loan, interest on capital, discount on bill, bank charge. به خاطر بعد خدمات بانگ یعنی مصرف کردن چی میکنه؟ چارج میکنه. میگه بدر دو سر دو پر دو چرا میگه بر تو دبت کار دا کرد. کار دا دی میری چی میکنه یه چیز. Loss by fire, accident or theft. جنسا گم میشه یا در میگیره یا؟ چی میشه تصادم میکنم و وقتان خراب میشه نخص میکنم یا میگنم چی هست مصرف میکنم So loss is also part of what? Expense basically in this case Donation If you gave donation Loss on exchange of currency Free sample Excise duty Custom duty BRT Business receipt tax Establishment expenses and so on این منوایی چی هست؟ انوایی مصرف هست شمایی رو پشت خواهدان یاد بگیرین که بعدان یا صد درصد چی هست؟ کار هست Next terminology is income and loss. Income means fayda ya mafad and loss means what? Khasara nukh zarar wala. How to find out income? Income is equal to if revenue is greater than expenses. Basically the formula is revenue minus expenses. If your revenue is greater than your expenses, the difference is called what? Fayda. Suppose revenue chi mona medot awad, expenses chi mona medot masaref. اوایی داد یک لگه افغانیست مسارفت اشتال از دار افغانیست چقدر بیست دار در اینجا مانده که یعنی بیست دار بانم چیاد میکنه؟ انکم بیاد لاست چی مانم میده؟ If your revenue is less than your expenses Revenue is 1 lakh Expenses is 1 lakh 20,000 So 1 lakh minus 1 lakh 20 become minus 20,000 Minus 20 can be called as what? As loss Right? So these are very important accounting terminologies Please remember this point Next one is uh, asset. 
asset but assets is the plural form of this one asset چی مونه میته دارایی درست است دارایی ها باید میگم ولی asset تنها دارایی گرفته میشه asset چی مونه میته assets are valuable things resources or properties owned by a business see the point if a business has valuable things or resources or building property and so on this can be called as what as asset it also includes the amount due to the business by others now let me explain in this one let me explain in simple words if anything is owned by a business and that one has a value that can be called as what as asset anything is owned by a business and that has a value that can be called as asset not by business anyone has something and that one has a value for example i have a computer it has a value it's asset i have a mobile it has a value it's asset i have a building it has a value it's asset i have cash it has value it is my asset so anything if you have and that has a value can be called as what as asset or it is the amount due to the business by others it is the amount due to the business it means uh, for those amounts that you have to receive from others for that one also we can call it what asset for example if you remember the previous videos i have mentioned regarding note receivable and account receivable so account receivable and note receivable is also an example of what example of asset so asset means anything which you have in the business and that one has a value can be called as what can be called as asset so simply you can say in this way anything which you have and that has a value can be called as asset types of assets asset can be current asset asset can be called as what non current asset right now let's go one by one for each type of and even non current assets is also divided into two part uh, then tangible fixed asset and non tangible fixed asset remember one thing more uh, non current asset also can be called as plant asset also can be called as what fixed asset i may use fixed asset later on instead of non current asset so current asset and non current asset both non current is but dubash tarsi mesha tangible and intangible number 1 current asset chi mona meta darai hai jari chi mona meta jari current assets are those assets which are easily convertible into cash within one financial year or within one accounting period those assets which are either cash or easily convertible into cash within how many years within one year asset hoy kumrishon yak sal as az yak sal ziyad nestan ye da zarf yak sal ba pul chi meshan dobara tabdil meshan ona ra banam chi yad nakran ba nam karan asset example of karan asset is cash bank balance or bank account account receivable i said before note receivable is also here inventory stock merchandise or goods all of these are example of what current asset prepaid expenses later on we will talk about prepaid expenses if you pay for example expenses in advance but tarum sal karay khane tan 50000 as magar tu 1 lakh rupya pesh pesh padafti to yezi 50000 pesh kho masraf karay khane 50000 rupya de gish paise tu sar sahib khane baqi memanam be banam chiyad magar prepaid expense so prepaid expense also is an example of what asset outstanding or accrued income shuma ba kasi khidamat anjam dadin magar aid tan tanus dariyaft nakaden ir ba nam chiyad mekana outstanding income short term investment you make investment sarmaye guzari mekini sarmaye guzari kot amadat not more than more than one year can be called as what as current asset right next one is non current asset also we can call it what fixed asset dariyai chi dariyai ke جاری نباشه یا داری های چی ثابت بنام یاد نکنم داری های ثابت بود و دو بخش تقسیم میشه so can be tangible and can be intangible tangible means داری های ثابت مرئی و قابل لمس اگه تعریفش چی شده tangible fixed assets are those assets which can be utilized for more than one year more than one financial year and have a physical substance those assets which can be used for more than one year if it is only one year we can call it what only current asset but if you use it for more than one year on that case we can call it what fixed asset but fixed asset is divided into two parts can be tangible can be intangible tangible means 
شکل ظاهری داشته باشه قابل تماس باشه قابل دید باشه خانه لند بلدنگ ماشین موتر کل زبان ها یاد میشه فکسر سده که تنجیبل باشه این تنجیبل ساری تنجیبل فکسر سده تنجیبل قابل تماس قابل دید شکل ظاهری داره تنجیبل فکسر اگزامپل اگزامپل اف دس مونت لند اند بلدنگ پلانت اند ماشینری وهیکلز فرنیچر اند فکسچر توس اند اکوپمنت اند سوار آل اف دیس ار اگزامپل اف وات نان کارن اسد وچ از تنجیبل دوستان این قسمت بعد مشکل دارم فرنیچر اند فکسچر فرنیچر اینمی در خانه به طور مثال میز است و غیره و غیره تیبل است فن است تی وی کلش چی است فرنیچر است اونایی که قابل موو هستن از یک جای به جای دیگه انتقال میگه فرنیچر میگه بوزو که در یک جای فکس شد به طور مثال پکه در چت امتو منظم فکس میشه نه دروازه منظم فکس میشه اور بنام چی میشه فکس چی یاد میگه دوستا ریمبر دوستا ان این تنجیبل فکس است دایره های نامل موس دایره های نامرئی این تنجیبل سورتوس اسید دات داز نات هاف انی فیزیکال سابستنس ان اور نان کارنت ان نیچر ایت مینز یوتیلایز فور مور دن وان اکاونٹنگ پیریڈ دوز اسیدز وچ ار یوز فور مور دن وان ایر اند دی داز نات هاف دی فیزیکال سابستنس وی کان نات سی دیم اور کورس وی کان نات تچ دیم رایت اگزامپل ترید مارک نوم بزنس ها لوگو و تار مثال لوگوی بزنس و غیره این داره بانم چیم بکنن ترید مارک یاد میکنن این از این پالا سای کنین جا گودویل امتیاز بزنس یا شورت بزنس یا اگران تا را گفته باشی دوکان تا مفروشی در دوکان چه قمال داری میگه سیلک میگه من سیلک در میگه نه دیوان هستی من امتیاز کار دارم گودویل چی مانا میتونه امتیاز مانا میتونه so if you if they if you have a good business so the value of your business increase due to good performance So that increase in the value of your business due to good performance can be called as what? As a good will. But if you did a bad performance, so there is no good will. Is it? Yeah, a good person is good. Well, I guess a good person is good. Is it? Well, I guess a good person is good. 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 I write a book, for example, or for example, I record this video, for example, right? So I'm the owner of this video. No one else can publish this video for himself. Or nobody can use this business, this video for him, for the, for himself, unless I authorize that, those guys. So even the copyright also can be called as what? As asset. If you want to write, if you want to use it, Then you have to pay for me. For example, in this video, for this video, Cardon is paying me. So that is why I record the video, right? Or for example, uh, I may have some other benefits from this video. So that is why I just uh, record the video. So this is called what? Copyright. This is also a kind of asset for the business. On the other side, we have this one, the liability. Liability, which means the cars, the debt, Liability or debts or obligations of liabilities or debts or obligations of the business or do or these are the claim of the outsiders on the asset of the business. Let me read once again. I'm a little bit confused. Liabilities or debts or obligations of the business or these are the claim of outsiders on the assets of the business. See the point. Liability means anything that you have to pay for the outsiders. Liability means cars. Liability means bidihi masuliyat. Any amount that you have to pay for the outsiders can be called as what? Can be called as liability. For example, it is time to pay rent, but rent is not paid yet. So the amount of rent to be paid in the future, you have to pay the rent. So that rent can be called as what? Liability. You have taken loan from the bank, but the amount is not paid yet. You have to pay loan. You have to repay the loan. So that can be called as what? As liability. You purchase something from Ahmad on credit basis and you promise to pay in the future. You have to pay it. So that amount can be called as what? As liability. So like asset, liability also can be divided into two parts. Can be called current, can be called as what? And current. Current liabilities or those liabilities that you have to pay within how many years? Within one year, like current asset. Current asset is the one that you have to pay for the next year. But current liability is the same thing. Current liabilities or those liability that you have to pay within one year. With the high jury, cars high jury, because that's a few years old, but it's a big deal. 
For example, account payable, note payable, outstanding expenses, مصارف های باقی مانده. کرای خانه پینجا آزار بود تو چل آزار پرداختی ده آزارش باقی مانده. باید ده دیگر هم چی کنی بپردازی. Income received in advance. تا اونوز در بزنس کار نکدی مگر ماش تا پیش از پیش چی کدی؟ وریافت کدی. This can be called income received in advance. Overdraft. For example, you have 10,000 in your bank account, but you issue a check to the bank to please give Mr. Ahmad amount of 50,000, right? You have, for example, 20,000 and you issue a check for 50,000. So the banker may accept your check, but it is only for some exceptional customers, not for everyone. Banker accept your check and pay 50,000. So 20,000 is used from your own money and 30,000 is paid from the bank account. So that is a negative balance in your bank account that can be called as what? Overdraft, you have to pay or repay for the bank account. That can be called as what? Also current language. Next one is short-term lo short loan. You take loan or cars for less than one year that, or at the max one year. That can be called as what? Short-term loan. So remember all of these, these are very important. Later on, we need all of this. Account payable, note payable, outstanding expenses, income received in advance, and so on. If you have any problem, then ask me. Then, second type of liability is long-term liability. Long-term liabilities are those liabilities that we have to pay after one year. Right? You have to pay, but you should not pay within one year after one year. For example, long-term long -term debt. Karzai told me that. Bond, for example. Bond is also a type of loan, but later on we will explain what is bond. For example, you want to take one million loan from the market, but one person may not be able to provide this loan for you. So in, say, in this case, in order to be able this, to take this 1 million from the market, what you can do, you can divide this amount of 1 million of one million dollar into, for example, 10,000 parts. How many parts? 10,000 parts. Then each part becomes, for example, $100. Then $100 is possible for everyone to provide. Let me explain in Persian. For example, می خواهیم که یک میلیون از بازار قرض بگیریم مگر یک میلیون یک نفر دو نفر تایه کده نمیتونه تو اینم یک میلیون با قسمت های بسا خرد خرد تقسیم میکنی میگه برو بدر خیلی تو نکو ما اینم یک میلیون میگه با ده هزار حساد چی میکنم تقسیم میکنم چند توتا که دیشه؟ ده هزار توتا کده اگر یک میلیون ده هزار توتا کنی هر توتش یا قسمتش چند ارزش داره؟ صد دولار ارزش داره. اینوله؟ صد دلار به هر کس دوستانه صد دلار من میتونم تا صد دلار رحمت میتونم رحمت میتونم صد دلار مبود میتونم اگر ده هزار نفر تو را صد صد دلار پیدا یک میلیون میتونه چی شه بعد از بیا اینمی می تاریخی بعد از آوردن قرض با نمیشه میکنه با من باند یاد میکنه لیتر آن وی ویل دیسکاس بعد اف کورس ات ویل بی دیسکاس این فاینانس سابجکتس لیتر آن رایت اند دی لاست اکاونتینگ ترمینالوجی از دس وان آنر اکویتی آلسو وی کان کال ات حق صاحبان شرکت دارایی شرکا سرمایه یا داری چی داری خالص represent the owner claim on the asset of the business ar on moqdar pul ke tawassut sahib business da business ma'rifi shoda ba nam chiyad nakana ba nam owner equity ya ba nam capital am metane chi kana sha yad kana sha in a running business the access of asset over liability is called what capital da ek business ke faaliyat dara ne capital ch to paida mekanem az majmu'i asset ta aga majmu'i liability ra kam kanem tafawut shoda ba nam chiyad nakana capital or we can say when amount is introduced by owner of the business to the business, we can call it what? Uh, we can call it capital. So these were the accounting terminologies. In the next video, inshallah, we'll talk about the gap. Thank you so much. Please do not forget to subscribe my YouTube channel by the name of Mohibullah Zamani. Thank